going back to the love of the game part, but like d- deeper than that, I think that one of the pitfalls for most humans is what I call the sort of myth of arrival. Interesting. And it's this idea that like, oh, well, when this happens, I will have arrived. When I get the scholarship, when I get the job, when I get her, you know, whether it's a relationship, whether it's a a professional achievement, whether it's a, then I will have arrived. Then I will be complete. Then I will have shown, you know, in a more (laughs) colloquial parlance, then uh, then the haters will know, you know, uh, and I'll have shown everybody and I'll be the man now. I can only speak for myself. I've had lots of those moments in my life. It's a myth. Because I don't want to say you have to get up the next day and do it again. But if you've chosen the right thing that matters to you, you get to wake up the next day and do it again. And the idea that we ever fully arrive or are complete is just, it's, it's, it's a hollow idea. And so when it comes to all this social media stuff, it's like, even if every single one of your friends sees it and likes it, I guarantee you they've forgotten about it 15 minutes later because they're obsessed with themselves and their life and their fears That's and right. their hopes. So like, um, again, I know it's hokey, but like the journey, the process, the, the, the like, why are you doing this? You know, in my world, I get asked all the time if people should go to film school or become like, what's it like, you know? And I always say, if you could see yourself being happy doing anything else, Go do that yeah. because this career will body you into a corner where you, you know, you get told no a lot, which is, there's a lot of parallels between the basketball world. Um, and if you don't really love this and like need to do it on a soulful level, you'd probably be happy.